You may recognize this man's face from the documentary, What the Bleep Do We Know? He is physicist Amit Goswami. In our interview with Dr. Goswami, we discuss everything from what God is to why our civilization has been stalled out in its evolution for the past 2,700 years to the modern interpretation of the Tibetan Book of the Dead and reincarnation, all of which is featured in his book, Physics of the Soul. He also explains that we cannot evolve as a species until we move away from negative emotions toward a life ordered by happiness rather than pleasure. We're uh, very clear. Uh, ethics was discovered in several different parts of the globe by uh, Moses, by Jesus, uh, by Socrates and Plato, by uh, Buddha and Rishis of the Upanishads. Uh, so uh, why haven't we pursued that. Uh, the number of people, proportionately speaking, that were quote-unquote enlightened in those days uh, has not changed uh, today. The, if you take proportionate number percentage, then it's roughly the same percentage that remains that, that becomes enlightened today. And uh, this is what it should not be if evolution is going on. So evolution is stalled. And, uh, the, Do you have any idea why? I, I think occurred? it is this instinctual circuits. We're not, we did not in, incorporate that in the stage of mental evolution. Mental evolution is now developing the rational mind, but we never incorporated how to deal with negative emotions. Negative mm -hmm. emotions have to be balanced with positive emotions. We came to the new stage too soon. We should have uh, developed brain circuits of positive emotions long ago. Yes. We didn't. We uh, moved into the rational mind, which of course uh, is logical, is step by step, and uh, therefore antithetical to that uh, illogical nature of feeling. Mm -hmm. And rational mind could not handle it. To handle it, rational mind has to surrender to the supramental. So although our spiritual teachers told us to surrender to the supramental, our rational mind, the more and more it understood science and understood how to handle the uh, natural phenomena outside of us, more and more it became daring, daring enough to defy the supramental. And that grew a kind of a uh, self-fulfilling prophecy of making the rational mind uh, supreme and yet slave to the negative emotions. Again, might this be a function of pleasure? Yeah, it is. Lack of wisdom, function of pleasure. Lack, lack of wisdom coming from being too attached to pleasure and pain. Yes. The emotions. We are attached to those negative emotions. We are attached to pleasure. We are attached to pleasure, even forgetting that pleasure eventually brings pain. We, we are ready to even forget that, but retain our attachment to pleasure. Mm -hmm. And that attachment has to be given up and uh, in favor of happiness. I hope you have a chance to enjoy this rare full-length conversation with this brilliant physicist and human being. For the full interview, go to ConsciousMediaNetwork.com.